Hello, my lovely Pisces. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Single Pisces, this is your reading for the month of July 2020. Sun, Moon, Rising Signs and Venus Signs. If you are considering yourself single or you've been for quite a while single or you break up with somebody single and you are right now single. This is your reading, Pisces. Let's see here what this month of July brings to you. Sun, Moon, Rising Signs and Venus Signs messages for the single Pisces. I'm using today the daily guidance angels for you, messages from the oracles, and as well I'm using the Gilded Tarot Royale for spirit and tarot messages. Let's see here, Pisces, what's the energy for you here and what we got here? We have wending and shower of abundance. There is something here coming for you. For some of you, there is about your relationship. Some For some of you, you are going to a celebration when you are my meet the person you are going to be with. The wedding card is marriage is a union of two souls joined in love, mutual respect and commitment. It signifies a desire to deepen love over time. Your wedding day is a testament to your well-founded faith in love's power. Continually breathe life into that faith and love, dear swan. I feel here there is some somebody here comes into your life in a very short time, Pisces. So it's kind of keep your eyes open and your arms as well open. Let's see here, loves, what we got for you. Single Pisceans, Sun, Moon, Rising Signs and Venus Signs. Messages for the singles. What we got for you, what you need to know, what's the predictions here. But I definitely get here an energy of a Pisces are about to meet somebody who can lead to long term and for some of you you have very good luck into your finances there is abundance coming to you Pisces but let's see here overall energy for this month we have the hermit a little quiet for some of you you might feel like yes I am all single feeling very single and very lonely and yes you are not Absolutely no. I do not agree with you, Piscean, because when you are in the hermit mode is a reflection for what you, you've been, what you need to. It's like a learning energy. And as well, the hermit is a very spiritual person. Also, you do carry with you an old soul. You might be young, but you might have an old soul. You might be a little older, but you definitely learn a lot into your life. Beautifully. There is some things here you're looking for. And they are about to enter your life. Absolutely. Let's see here. Four of Pentacles. Six of Wands. King of Swords. Queen of Pentacles, Three of Cups, Page of Wands, King of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, and Page of Cups. All right, loves. I feel here you are dealing here strongly with a, an air, a, pardon me, with a fire sign, but you are more in a friend energy than in a lover energy okay it's like you want more from them whatever i feel here is like yes you feel many times lonely but i don't feel you are completely lonely here there is a there's a couple here who needs to restore even there is for the singles i pick up very much energy of something here you cannot get over it. You need to. We have King of Swords, Queen of Swords. The talk between you and this person, it's sharp. There are two good minds here. 
They are good things between you two. King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles. But something here is holding on. For some of you, you might just date or you might see this person as a friend. You might have children. You both been married before. But there is a good connection between you two. Because I feel here there is something here needs to be restored. Okay, Piscean. And to not act that cold and that like formal. The passion and love it's here and needs to be restored. For some of you, you you've been married, both of you, with whoever you are connected here, you could be a long-term friend. Okay? Some of you might be even a widow. Somebody here, you know, I don't feel you are with previous partners. I see you like more in a friend's way. But it's a hold on here. And hold on on the like, the talk, the, the familiarity of each other. I don't feel you're dealing with the Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I don't feel you're dealing with the Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. For some of you might deal with the Virgo. For some of you might deal with an air sign. That's not the thing. What I do see here, Pisces, is very much like you are two good friends. You could have family, you know. And the other thing I feel here, you both holding on on, on a movement forward. It's like too much talk, not too much action. And now you see like, what's the problem? What's the problem in here? You both might had previously family, you know, kids previously. You could be friends of the friends, things like that. But you care, love and passion for each other. It's like, I see like that child happiness child energy pretty same the same age here but there is a hold on in here somebody here still hold on although i feel here there is it's kind of by the next holiday whatever is your next holiday or it's on a holiday or on a celebration here you get together i feel here right now you might not be together with this person. Okay. And for some of you, your kids might be friends, each other, and might bring you together. Let's see here. Four of Pentacles. Five of Swords. You don't really believe that this could work. This could get being to, to be stable. Somebody here doesn't really believe in this, but this will happen. This will happen. Because there is a lot of manifestation energy here. It's like, I don't believe it, but I get everything I need to, to believe it. But I'm not sure. I'm not sure if this is a good fit for me. But I definitely see here it's a very good fit. You have a lot of people around you, loves. Let's see. It's like you are two sharp minds. Like both of you come from a very organized energy. Somebody here lost some things. I've been like, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what it I work. Somebody here doesn't have that, you know, the confidence that things can work. It's like one of you is a note like, yes, we can go, like move and this and that. Another one is like, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if this will work. But the passion is there. For some of you Pisces, one of you, you both, 
know each other a long time and one of you it's it's hard for them to settle down because they feel like if I'll settle down I I will not can it's like the commitment I I offer is not quite there or will not be seen that and somebody here doesn't want to give up on their freedom you know this person Pisces you know this person you might feel it's kind of complicated and things like that but I definitely see here this connection kind of work if one of you will not be in that like oh I'm not sure if works I'm not sure it's like get over that and move forward get over that and move forward if somebody here is afraid to not hurt the other person that's the thing here could be you Pisces could be the other person Mm -hmm. I feel here you are the one who is very much afraid to not hurt or to not be hurt okay the other person does want a stable energy here in their life even marriage and I'm not sure if they told you that there is a, about a legal marriage here a legal commitment here because ace of swords many times is signing documents justice as well legal documents here somebody here it's it's afraid to give up their single life also for some of you very very small portion of you you could live with this person long time and never been a selling down energy here and now is the time to selling down and I feel here for some of you one of you is so mature another one is like I still have other things better or it's it's hard to 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 give my like you know the the bachelor life behind but I definitely see here there is a good energy between you two and this can move forward but somebody here needs to give up on those ideas that like I cannot work through I cannot make it and things like that because whoever is afraid to live that single life they can't make it work and many people have an idea if I give up my single life I will be not free you can be free in a marriage you can have all the freedom in the world if you decide to be with somebody that's mean you really love that person you really care for that person you really want to be with that person and if you are afraid that's mean that person is not the one if you feel like they will take your freedom that's mean that's not the one but for some of you definitely here is that thing it's it's kind of i'm talking with with a pisces who have been prior with somebody your person also have been prior it's like you both had families and things like that but one of you left their spouse because they've been cheated on and one of you left the spouse because that person one that person died basically it's a widow and it's hard for them to to move forward and also somebody here is very much afraid about the selling down energy here but I feel here communicating clearly thou can move forward this energy because I see here there are two people here who are very very compatible and can work forward and like the talk between you two it's great 
and will improve as you've been honest that the things like the earthly things are as well good but i feel here the passion and love expressing and things like that needs to be learned or things like that and whoever is in a hermit mode needs to take out from that okay because for some of you, you might feel like, yes, I am. I don't want to be lonely. I don't want to die lonely and things like that. You never die lonely. Never, ever. So one of you doesn't need to resist whatever it's coming. And it's like, be on the same page. There is this three of cups here. Like if you've been friends and coming together, and that friendship is going to be more than a friendship. All right, loves. I hope I got some answers for some of you. It's a very, very strong energy coming back and forth, back and forth. And sometimes the reading can go very, you know, back and forth and could be confusing because the energy usually as you know i do read the energy i don't read the person and that's what's coming here and spirit says look for the abundance so you'll get more abundance what you put in the universe that you get more but i feel here this is your life partner it's like you know this person pisces for a long time long long time and yes loves this is what i got for you single pisceans love and light to all of you thank you for watching being here on the channel blessings for all of you we'll see you next time namaste